The mom who quite literally took a leap of faith to save her baby, she jumped out of three stories out of her burning apartment building, cradling her kid in her arms. I just knew that we were either gonna die or we were gonna get out of there. Christina says her son Cameron's safety was her number one priority. There's no way that my life would be more valuable than his. He's my number one. Ten, waited 10 months for it. Nothing so close to home. I'm home. That's mom. The first best day of my life was almost 22 <laughs> years ago, and this is the second best day of my life. In Indiana, surviving and saving. When her house wasn't enough to protect them, Stephanie Decker shielded her children with her own body. The love of my children it goes beyond anything else in this world. Even giving up her legs for them. As the tornado bore down, she acted, dashing with eight-year-old Dominic and five-year-old Reese into the basement, the house being sucked away around her, protecting them with her body. 12-year-old Christopher Ward has overcome more than his share of obstacles. He's a joy to be around. He's always happy. He's never complained. Despite the rare condition with no cure that left him legally blind as a baby, a breakthrough. Hackley learned about eSight glasses, a new product that combines a high-resolution camera with a user's own prescription lenses. A recent demo session proved to be the moment Hackley had been praying for. Chris could see his mom clearly for the first time. When I looked at her, she was pretty. But it wouldn't be that simple. The glasses come with a $15,000 price tag. Whatever it takes to raise the money for it is from day one, that's what I was determined that I was going to do. Their mom is deaf, so they slowly reveal the unbelievable news. We found your mom, our grandma. She's found your alive. mom. Yeah, mom. On a laptop back in St. Louis, Zella's anxiously waiting to see her daughter for the very first time in nearly 50 years. It's your mother. <laughs> That's your mom! Mommy! Oh my gosh! Leo, who has a rare disorder affecting his vision, had never had a good, clear look at the world. So the glasses were there to fix that. In the video, it shows the moment he first puts them on and first looks straight into his mother's face. And there's that hesitation, and then there it is. Obviously, Leo likes what he sees. That smile was something that was so different. Yeah, it was just, a, it was just remarkable. Yes, it was remarkable. So here's one last look at this first look.